Cobertura Canaltech Ciab 2016. Um oferecimento IBM. My name is Robert Brinkman and I'm a infrastructure architect for IBM for banking and financial markets and I've been asked to talk about what is blockchain and why are people interested? Why are banks interested in this technology? Blockchain very simply is a distributive ledger. It enables multiple organizations in a business network to share a common ledger. By sharing that common ledger, they have one set of books and that set of books reduces a lot of complexities that sit there today and a lot of costs that's in their infrastructure. So by having this common set of books using blockchain technology, I can simplify my business processes. And that makes me more competitive, makes me more uh, viable in my, in my industry. And one of the things that we're doing is we're going to run this on System Z. So I'm going to have Luke introduce yourself, talk about you know, why is blockchain on Z? What makes it interesting? Well, thank you, Robert. My name is Luke Fervec and I'm on the worldwide sales team of uh, Z. And one of the applications we're selling, indeed, is blockchain. And Z, I mean, as Robert explained, it's a replicated ledger. And obviously, because of that replication, a lot of technology, security features, identification of participants, etc., is very important. And there, exactly, Z is very strong because it has all the capabilities of being scalable, about being secure, and having all those processes included in the system. And that's why we are very efficient in running this blockchain technology. Well, and uh, indeed, uh, on mainframe, Linux is very important, and we're very much into open source. So, Robert, uh, can you please tell how blockchain and open source go together? Well, for us, our intent is to make blockchain adopted by the industry. So to gain that industry adoption, we have to make it open source. So by making what we're doing is we're publishing all the technology we have and we're providing it to the Linux Foundation. The Linux Foundation is picking that up and they're going to make it available, run it on System Z, run it on the cloud, run it in your own private infrastructure, you're going to have all those options because we are making it open source. And that's critical for its adoption. And clearly, because we're making blockchain open and we're making it available and we're going to build these business networks, a lot of financial organizations are saying, how do I use this? What are the use cases? Luke, you want to talk about those? Yeah, well, we see indeed uh, all of the financial institutions, and by the way, not only financial institutions, but also many other industries are looking into this, and not only looking, because we have an awful lot of POCs, experiments, pilots going on right now of financial institutions working with us on real use cases and developing them on our infrastructure and we're seeing very uh, good progress on that and we'll see first systems in production as of probably next year. So uh, that's what we're doing right now.